Hi, welcome to Quasar. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can evaluate derivative and integral using this Casio F792S GA calculator. This calculator can only evaluate, which means it will give you a number. And for the derivative also, it will give you a number. It will not solve your equation or uh, just uh, integral of a value. This you solve, it, solve the definite integral so here we have a function which says integrate and the sine of x from pi over 2 to pi as you can see on the plot so when you do the integral you are actually evaluating finding the value under the curve in this case from pi over 2 to pi this area under the curve so let me turn on the calculator make sure you are in normal mode if not press mode and then 1 you are in normal mode and this the angle is very important because here the angle is in radian make sure your uh, calculator is also set in radian so now it's in degree press shift setup number four radian and now uh, calculator is ready so now enter our function so sign for x this blue x will activate with alpha alpha x and then close it with the right arrow go to the right it will come and move here so pi over 2 shift pi for pi this was the switch that I pressed the button so pi divided by 2 and then with the arrow go to the right it goes up and then shift pi press equal sign it will calculate the uh, area under the curve to be 1 so you can use other values if you wish so now for the derivatives let's say we have an equation here that um, this is the position of a of an object and you want to find the velocity at two seconds the three and four seconds so when you take the derivative of a function it will be the velocity so now this is f prime so these are the derivative so we want to evaluate the derivative at two seconds at three and four seconds so which means we will take the derivative and plug in the value so the calculator will do that all at once for us so press shift and then this is the derivative now enter our function 2x squared minus 5x so 2 and then alpha x squared minus 5 and then alpha x plus 3 and then with the arrow go to the right now we are doing the first one so it means take the derivative and evaluate it with x equal 2 so this is 3 now to do again with another value just press left arrow go there change it to 3 and evaluate it so we got 7 go back and 4 so we got another value this way you can evaluate thank you for watching if you like the video please thumb up and also please subscribe